MSc Public Administration is a three semester program which is 18 months and it has um, a total of 54 credit units which you are about to see now and then on the first semester you are expected to register these courses uh, GST 807 is very much compulsory, which you must pass in order to graduate if you don't want to uh, take on a, a fresh semester, an additional semester. Do not ignore GST 807. So you have all these courses, and here are the credit units BHS. 801 and all that and then the cost registration fee is here which is uh, the payment for the cost materials based on the credit units for postgraduate programs and exam fees all calculated very well to amount to 90,000 naira that's your first semester fee yeah uh, this first semester compulsory fee is 35,000 uh, unlike uh, the messages that goes around sometimes it's 36 although the difference is not much it's 1,000 uh, for undergraduates it's 36 for postgraduates it's 35 35,000 so the total uh, of 90,000 is what you're supposed to pay for the first semester. Now, there are 26 total credit units because this year we have 26. And out of the 26, you are expected to pass at least 24 of them. You can register all if you want. I have registered 24 this semester and then take the remaining two to maybe uh, second semester or third semester and put it there. You can do it that way if you want to carry all of them. So, but for now, it's only 24 that is required of you. 24 units. You must pass up to 24 units here, which means you can only maybe fill one course, one elective from here. So in this case, even if they are all electives, uh, you are not allowed to skip all of them because they are electives. You must meet this requirement, 24 units. The second semester, we have 12 units. You are required to pass up to 12 units from this 14. There are 14 here, and 12 are required. And your fee is 49500 because the composite fee has reduced to 18,000, no longer 35,000, and the registration fee for uh, and the, for the both exams and course materials is not 35,000, and these are your courses. There's no more GSTs. And your final semester, which is the third semester, these are your courses. Uh, you have these are non-examinable, all of them. Seminar, practicum, and uh, research project. Uh, dissertation, which is 40,000 for registration of this dissertation. And you have a total of 72,000. You will have to register for the semester to actually get 18,000. Every semester you are taking exams or making a registration you will have to you will have to firstly pay a composite fee of 18,000 that's why you should not play with your studies it's very hard I know for MSc students to concentrate but you see this public health well and some others don't even try <laughs> spend your time on your studies so you are 
expected to pass a minimum of 50 credit units and you have a total of 54 unit courses so out of the 54 you are expected to reach at least this 50 in this 50 GST must be there don't joke with it I keep saying this don't joke with GST courses yes unless GST 8 to 7 uh, if you are uh, if you if you finish your first degree in now national sure university then just 807 is not for you you can skip it so that's it